we go. All right. So I think we have a little recap to do um, since I was not there last week to record. Should we just do a quick run through? Oops, wrong one. So we were at 4.8 at the beginning of last week, I think. And it would help if I shared my screen. About now. Four point eight should be up. Yeah, so the aha ta percentage percentage. I don't know how you say that. Can you make it smaller? Okay. So aha. Ta pesejet ash segabu a'a er her and ne berger use then her jed and f ich or ash in Coptic. Ich na madu madu e jedke meti ben this is can't remember what that word is wash wow 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 sajum too all right so then the Ennead cried out, gave a great cry before the Lord of all things. Uh, and they were saying to him, uh, why, I can't remember how this goes, why are the words, um, you said, why are there the words that you said, which should not, which are not worth listening to something like that? Is it why or is it what? I thought it was what? Yeah, what, which, who? Okay. So then I'll take it like, what are the, what are the words that you said, which are not, not Sha Sejim to? Yeah, they're not worthy of listening to them. Right. Worthy of being listened to, I think we decided Sejim to was a passive. That makes sense. And then the, the little U at the end would be the, the object. They which not are worthy, listen to them. Yeah, so there's a double relative there, one unmarked and one marked by Neti. I guess, huh? Inti bin like nested. Yeah. Nested relatives. Because it's the words that you, why, what are the words that you said, which they are not worth listening to? Mm hmm. Okay, okay. I guess, huh? That makes some sense. So like, why are you saying that? I guess. Okay. Kind of... Like, what are these words? What are you saying? Um, okay. Ich interrogativo, which, what? Okay, all right, I'll take that. Cool. Should we look at the hieratic or go on? We should go with the hieratic because we didn't do that last time. All right. So then, acha is normal. Ta, our normal. Uh, which we'll call it um, ligature. The best jet, which I still don't know how to write. One day I'll figure it out, like what the sequence on this is. Is it one, okay. two, three? Maybe, possibly, who knows? The three gods in a row, followed by a bird on a stick and the vertical plural strokes. Ash, Sagab, we have this more than once now. Sagab has a little ooh at the end. Interesting, tiny one. Uh, this really squished um, tooth hieroglyph, but that's what it always looks like. Should look something like, you know, do we have a, a tool for that? Tooth, for some reason I thought it was a finger. Fingers are written differently, okay. Tusk, things like <laughs> an elephant tusk. Uh, okay, 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 that makes sense. The finger is more like this, 
like standing up. Yeah. This yeah. one down. Yeah, Not yeah. Very similar, you're right. And hieratic, this one always becomes something like this. It almost looks like an ear or a horn or something. But yeah. I messed that up. That should have been one, two, three, I guess. Although, wait, you can't go back up, what am I saying? So maybe one, two, three. I think that's what it is. Mm. Although, sort of, this is tempting to, to think it goes up, isn't it? Like, sort of mm. not like it. I just don't know if that works mechanically. <laughs> yes. It's not too bad. It's like a little, little loopity, like a very loopy end, the first stroke. So maybe it does go up. I'm not sure. We'd have to dig a bit more. Okay. Or um, with the with the book roll underneath. Or then something strange happens. Yeah. Have you heard about this before? I have no idea how you know that was hair. Mm -mm. Yeah, that's that's not immediately intuitive, is it? Like, like the divine determinative is pretty clear, so maybe you just guess. But well, or maybe it is some kind of ligature that we just haven't encountered yet. Should we take a look? We can yeah, look. We've got a lot of we've got a lot of interesting hairs in this document. What would it be ligatured with, though? Like, um, I was thinking, like when when you write it together with the you write not really a. A determinative. By the way, guys, is my audio terrible? It may be. If yes, let me know. It, it's doing the occasional very loud static thing, but otherwise it's fine. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'll get a new headset. I mean, I'll get a headset, period. The old one's broken. <laughs> there it is. There is normal horror, which doesn't look like this at all. Ah, that's what I was thinking. Like, if you write it with the determinative stroke, um, like in the sailor, it looks like this. I remember that. Uh, uh, so you can really see the, the face, and then there's the big determinative next to it. However, in the New Kingdom, let's take a look. No, there is no New Kingdom. I mean, it sort of becomes this weird thingy here, right? It almost looks like a ha. Mm -hmm. Is there more of this? No, not really, that's it. I was thinking it looks more like one of the volume two examples, like without like without the determinative stroke, it just, they have kind of just that wiggle, that same shape. Mm -hmm. We scroll up. You're right, you're right. So I think that's what it is, this thing here. But I guess you have to sort of know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Then I think the nebs. Are, I think the nebs are pretty interesting too. Where it's like, it's got this little stack of something on in the bowl. Uh, so like the neb, the neb air jar. I think the nebs are kind of cool like that. So yeah, that one's particularly like abbreviated. Right. Yeah. Like the um, the T from the previous line. It's actually, that's what yeah, it's coming down. That's a different stroke. You can see it's a different color if you zoom in. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Because otherwise it would be really weird. Um, but it's yeah. just, it's just abbreviated, like well said. Um, yeah. You know, drawings. It should look like this. And instead, it just is. Whee! <laughs> that's really it. So yeah, this one's pretty abbreviated. Yeah. Then our uh, Jer, that's comparatively normal. Um, bird on the stick is then, I think we've seen all this before. Here's a more like what I would call a more normal. Uh, yes. But that we already got used to. Is that extra bit from the previous line? Like the, I think it's an R. Yeah. It's, it's a W. Oh, wait, which one do you, what do you mean? Um, uh, go back to that. So it's this bit right here. The one coming down into the hair, oh. the diagonal. Yeah, that, that, yeah that's from above. I think, or okay. is it a W? It's a, it's a, it's a W. Oh, uh, 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. You're right. It is. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, there's a T in between. That's why. Eat it. And then. Yeah. Eat it. Okay. Something they that he doesn't do yet that people later do a lot for the jet, like the there's this really this one becomes more and more extreme, this part. But he doesn't mm -hmm. this is still kind of kind of normally dimensioned, but this thing becomes bigger and bigger. Kind of kind of impressive. But he doesn't have that, I think. Or maybe he has it later. I'm not sure. Um, Nef, Ich, again, Z shape bookwell. Na, Medu, we haven't looked at before. Omed. So that's kind of interesting. It almost looks like a little E, but it has some extra stroke on there. It tells you it is not a read leaf, it's something else. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I guess that, that deserves a look. I think the, the D hand. Going down into the T is a fun ligature too that I hadn't seen a whole lot of. So. The D into the T. You mean this year? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so mid does not exist. What am I doing wrong? Medu? Maybe medu? Yeah. There you go. Oh, that's interesting. So it almost looks like left, middle, some stroke from the side, and then finish it off at the bottom. Mm -hmm. I have no idea why, to be honest. I mean, how do you get from here to here? <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't call that intuitive. But it is what it is. So I guess if we see a shape like that, like a like a little like a very compressed Coptic F, and then something coming from the side. Like a phi. Hmm. Okay. Cool. Although honestly, I would claim this here is the other way around, right? This looks like this this is coming from the right and then going down. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so this one takes a bit of getting used to. This guy is normal. Oh man. Look at that screw on here. I think it's an interesting K. Yeah. It's kind of tucked in at the bottom there. Yeah. It's sometimes you see that where it's like really going down instead of going like, they like to do this thing but sometimes you really have 90 not 90 degree but yeah this is 90 degree version like going all the way down i also feel like the k is darker than the signs before and after it so i wonder if yeah. he went back and added that that's why it's down below the others i think you noticed that, that, that you missed something you're right yeah Egetic. Right, the words that you said. Is that a relative? That's a relative, right? Yes, we decided it. Well, last time, like, we thought it was a relative. I think that makes sense. And now comes a relative phrase with NT. NT Ben Shao. So Shao. That's almost like a Coptic already, right? Yeah, it's very like a shy. Mm -hmm. Oh, then, then he binds it over to the R. Interesting. You can see that little little curve that's coming back. Hang on. Mm -hmm. Nice. What else? Um, and a U, a book row, our walking ear. I mean, also <laughs> like the sign for, for walking, but with the extra little thing on top. Yeah, that is weird. Uh, normally in the Middle Kingdom, it looks more like this, like the snail. I don't know. I'm not sure. Do you even think that looks like a snail? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The head with the, the, oh, the yeah. cell behind. Yeah. <laughs> so jump to close. Okay, next sentence.
Mm, I haven't looked at it yet, so let's try that real quick. So, Jed in her C or Sa um, Ise, then, then said Horus, the son of Isis, Ben Nefer Iuna, I guess. Yes, Ben Nefer Iuna. By by Gabu or Gabui, I don't know what we want to make out of these these double uh, weak consonants at the end. To wait, I'm struggling here a little bit. Um, so then, bin Yunu is is negation or whatever is in between. Right. So it's not good, basically. Yeah. It's not good. It's not. good. Good. Pi this. Gabui, gabui tu, emachta pesajit. What's gabui? Um, it's like che cheating or. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So cheating this... me. Where do we get the me from? Is it oh, the, the me at the very end? We had a long discussion about that. <laughs> Okay. So so far it's just this cheating before the the Ennead. Interesting. I don't know what to make out of the two, honestly. In front yeah. of them, let, let's go and, on and see what the rest. In brings. terms of the word division too, it seems like um, Gab goes from the pot, the um, the eagle, the the bird. I'm sorry, the leg, the W and then it has the little determinative for the bad bird, mm -hmm. right? Okay. And then there's the two right there. And then in, box, in the presence of, uh, okay. I mean, this cheating, would that be an infinitive? And if it's an infinitive and you put a two at the end, could that be this cheating me? That's what I was taking it as, yeah. Although you'd sort of expect like a little A1 man afterwards. Uh, mm -hmm. Right, right. Or, or something, if it's supposed to be me. But what else could it be? Because otherwise it's kind of unmotivated a little too there, right? Talking about cheating, should we? Nice. <laughs> 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 It's called a second opinion. I mean, if I had a nickel uh, for every unmotivated two we've found in this text. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I was just going with Turney and Grawls. Sometimes there's a two at the end and we don't know why. Oh, um, really? Is there? <laughs> so yeah, we're on page 27 of Ramsey's. There it is, yeah. Here you go. Ben, Nefer, not good. Ona or Yuna. Oh, I see, okay. I get, okay, so he ignores the, the they ignore the, uh, yeah, Gebit, Gebiti. So they, they interpret that as an infinitive with a, uh, a first person. We're missing. Yeah. So they don't do the, the The article is possessive, though, right? The article is what? I'm sorry? Is, is the article possessive? Mm. I was wondering about that, if it would be, but I think that's just the demonstrative, if there's nothing else after it. Like okay. this, this, uh, this cheating, this cheating of mine, this cheating me. Mm. If it were, if it were possessive. Oh, it's this. Okay, yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, go ahead. No, no. Yeah. All right, let's continue. Um, so this cheating of mine in front of the, of the tapesajit, in front of the Ineat. M2, M2 is the conjunctive, or yeah, con conjunctive, yeah. The, conjunctive, the connecting form. Um, and and something, Nechem, taken away, stolen, ta yaud, the office, and it, or yod, and it, uh, I guess my father, Osiris. So, or really, father of Osiris. Go again. I'm sorry. 
There's no possessive there, right? I kind of need one in English, but you you can right. you can always you can always leave out the um the um yeah uh, first person suffix pronoun that can always be left out and it's often put in too. Right. So I guess this means, um, and it being stolen or taken away, the office of the father Osiris or the office of my father Osiris, we don't know. And then so there was some discussion around MD. Yeah. Um, and I guess that's then from me. Which makes sense because that can be used for some other things where it means from. Although normally in Coptic later, it becomes the, the genitive, the ente. So mm -hmm. basic meaning is with, I think. Yes, that's the basic meaning in late Egyptian too, but. Yep. So we decided it was an idiom. That, that is marking the indirect object of both of the previous verbs. Yes. That makes sense. Who's being cheated, who's having the office taken away. Or the cheating is happening with Horus, the office is being taken away from being with him. Yeah, someone pointed out on um, Discord that um, like uh, like in is is uh, what happens before the verb, and so with is what happens before the verb. So the cheating from me, or the cheating, or the uh, taking of the office from me. Okay, makes sense. I mean, that, that seems pretty logical. Okay, so grammar straightforward. Let's go through the hieratic. A curb bird. Click on a stick. The saw that looks like a paw without wings. Um, the Isis thingy here. Ligature T into the egg. Makes sense. Burn, like you would expect. Nefert, like you would expect. Um, this here, I think we may have looked up before, this highly stylized form, they also do that for the cow. So mm -hmm. where it just looks like basically a big hook and then a tiny little R afterwards or something, that's normal. Um, here he ligatures again. So a U going straight into an R. Big, beautiful A2. R with wings. Double stroke, but this could be anything from context, a G ligatured into another Aleph bird, a B, a U, bad bird, the traditional form here in this, this, I mean, the typical form for this document, two, I think we're familiar with that, M, that really big in front, and Bach. Nothing surprising, I think, so far. Our Ennead, triple, triple gods, M2. This one here, you just have to know, right? M2. Yeah. <laughs> Nechem is surprising, but I guess it makes sense when you think about it. Um, Has he done the, the M sign that way before with the square bottom? Not really. Yeah. It seems odd to me. I think we had it once before, didn't we? I don't yeah, know. it does seem like a familiar word from previously. It may have been in, in Himse to sit, but I could be wrong on that. Yeah, Ra gets up from his tent and sets down with the, uh, yeah, at some point. Yeah, doesn't he sit down with the Iliad again or something after after being offended? Right. Yeah. Yeah, it's line three. Oh, line Four three. Point. Okay. Oh, oh yeah. Three. Line three. Oh yes. Let's take a look. Always getting offended. <laughs> yeah, but even before that, like way early. Let's see. Yeah, I'm sure there's an earlier one too. Yeah. Line three. Sorry, page four. There's one. There's one right, right at the top. Oh, yeah. In the damage area. Oh, look at that. Yep. Oh, there it is. Yeah. 
that's more what I was expecting. Yes, that really marked downward stroke, right? And okay, I don't see that here. But then again, there's nothing underneath. Is there another one? The one on the third line of the fourth page also has the downward stroke, but it's it also has the Z underneath. So maybe that makes a difference. Okay. Yes, so. Huh? Yeah, maybe. Over here. I remember we talked about oh, that, yeah. what the sequence was. And I think we came up with like dup, dup, dup. And then down here, I really don't know. Do you do the do you do this first and then just finish it off that way? That would be kind of kind of natural, but normally Z is horizontal tick. So you, you change your stroke order just after Khimsa. Maybe that's what you do. Like picture wise. It could be. Hmm. Where were we? Dup, 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 dup. Okay, so a horizontal hum, complemented by M, and the strokes that apparently nobody knows what to do with. Okay. Are they just part of the word then, or just kind of extra? That would be a question for Mr. Where is it again? I think that's in Lesko as part of the spelling. Okay, yeah, I, I think that's right. I mean, Alan says at some point those strokes are hieratic abbreviations for something that's too complicated to draw, but. But there isn't anything here, is there? I think often we don't know what, what they would have been. Right. Great, going the wrong way. Before. Yeah, it's the first stage, I think. It helps if you have a bad cold. Wait. <laughs> yes, yes, it does. There you go. So, do you yeah. want to put two strokes or three strokes? <laughs> oh, no, stop. I... <laughs> you can have one as well if you like. <laughs> Part of the word, okay, cool. Go figure. Huh. So could it stand for the, the M or the, the M with the hand on top of it or something? You mean the, 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 the two, two strokes? The two strokes. Yeah. It could be, right? But I don't know. It's a big mystery in my mind. Why would you, I mean, if you just wrote ne. But yeah, we already have an M here, so. Right. So it doesn't really add any any value, does it? Could you accidentally like confuse it with something else? Not really, right? I mean. Interesting that Nechbet is written with an M as well. That's wild. Mm -hmm. Just looking at other words to see if there's like some kind of value add by. It doesn't look like it. I don't know. We need this time machine. Why? <laughs> that all about. Yeah. Okay, doc. Let me finish this up real quick, so then we can do the next sentence. Um, Man with a stick, ta, e out. We had that several times, so nothing new here. That funky min fetish, wasn't it? Yes. Min fetish. What do you want to share about yourself? I have a min fetish. Um, <laughs> oh, that's awesome. This is a great conversation starter for you. <laughs> That is a great conversation starter, definitely. Oh boy. Um, so what's up with the little extra thingy 
on top of yeah that's that's a technical term in the oh is that maybe just part of the the scroll that got lifted up off the page this one is like no yeah it's probably just part of the scroll it's oh you mean the, the <laughs> yep that thing right there he does that he does the the scroll in three different ways um uh, I remember looking into that before. Yeah, that. that makes sense. Yeah, okay. So he has this one with a tick. Wait, I'm, I'm doing this very poorly. Uh, oh. um, blah, 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 blah. Let's look. This is ligatured with the scroll and the, and the plural dots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just like this. Or yep. he has, uh, if it's underneath something else, it's the Z. Uh huh, uh huh. There's all three. And I've not been able to work out when he puts the ticket when he doesn't. I think it's more a matter of, I don't know if there's anything meaningful to it. Oh, wait, I messed that up, didn't I? Um, sorry, the plural is, is under this, what am is I saying? the space there maybe just the ink inks, uh, dried out? <sighs> or is it just the resolution? Am I making, probably making too much of this? Mm. Then here he uses one to distinguish the the normal hand from the from the hand with to give, or maybe also the hand with the stick, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Who wants the next one? Cool. 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 I can try it. It's been a while. If nobody else wants to go, go for it. Okay. So let's see, aha uh -huh, n. So then, uh, asked Isis Kend came furious R at Ta Peshed the nine. U.S. then hair or U.S. I think U set. Um, then she hair irit made an ankh, an oath. Um, looks like that's Necher Emba in the presence of the god. Ta Peshed Jed M saying in the presence of the nine saying Ankh Muti as my mother lives as my niece uh, my mother lives, Necheru, uh, Necher, Necheret, as my mother lived, Newt, the goddess, Ankh, uh, oh, I guess maybe that's a continuation of Ankh Ptah, so as Ptah lives, yeah. uh, Taten N, in, in the land of Taten, maybe? Uh, ka raised up high. Oh, with raised up high, shooty feathers. Hennen. Uh, what is that? Bender. Oh, maybe that's a title as well. Oh, oh, oh! This is the this is the like clover of cor of horns or something like Abu. Um, so shooty ahead is plumes or high feathers, and henan would be like the bender of horns somehow. I don't really know what that's all about, but and then let's see. Yeah, you okay? So it goes over two lines. Yui is the horns and Necheru of the god of the gods. Something like that. Did I miss anything there? Let's see. Yeah, then I just became furious at the nine and she made an oath before the gods. Uh, yep. And the nine saying, as my mother neath the goddess lives and as the ta of Taten, the high plumes lives bender of the horns of the 
gods. And then would you be the start of the next sentence? Right. So all that's yeah. introducing, does she swearing by all of that? And then the EU introduces the next clause, which is what she actually wants to happen during because of oh, you. Ta, ta, ta. Yeah. oh, so look, but ta ta then oh. does have the, the plumes. Oh, and okay. horns. So he's, he's got yeah, the horns. horns. <laughs> so this is me not having any background in livestock or anything like that is like when you bend the horns or maybe the horns that he's wearing is bent maybe that's what it is was it bent I, or i thought it was like trimmed or blunted or decorated okay. or something Curl is one of the Curl. translations too right. yeah I, I don't know what that means um, okay. what's the word that is i'm struggling with that i mean uh, it's waff waff okay yeah what, just let's go let's go say that it is Wow. With an ein. Yeah. I have Abu for horns and I've got Henan for bender of horns. Bender of horns. That sounds so weird. To crush, to subdue, there we to go. Line. Ah. So it feels like a taming thing, but. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, I read it, I thought about that, like, like where they put balls on the end of the bull's horns and then. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Okay. You can't gore anybody like, while they're being taken off to sacrifice. <laughs> yeah, well, that makes sense. That makes sense. But that's or a different. It could be, um, so he's sort of like taming the horns of the gods. Yeah. 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 Still trying to find. Oh, the I saw you, you. You scrolled past it. I Page saw. Page ninety-five it. at the top, or near the top. This one here, right? The one to serve. Waff. Waff. F. Oh, waff. Oh, one. There's an F in it. Yeah. Yeah. Where's the F? So the F is not written, but Gardner has a footnote saying this is presumably waff. Oh, okay. All right. Well, that's oh, where I got it. Yeah. That, yeah. I was trying to look for something that. There we go. To crush, to curb, to bind. So presumably, he recognizes the epithet. But... Huh. Okay, so who was Totten or? What's his name? Uh, Yeah, yeah, Patatan. Thank Pata you. Is the personification of the primordial ground, the Ben Ben. Yep. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. And so just general ordering of chaos? Or should I just say, hey, this is something they called each other and that's good. Maybe the first appearance of something within chaos, but I don't think he has the ordering, maybe. Okay. And often it's trans it's transcribed as ta ta dash ta Oh, okay, okay, okay. Or ta Yeah, you're right. You're right. right. Combined deity. I'm still so, the horn bending thing. Ta 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 Long well, standing member of the horn bending club. There was there was a name uh, of a hallway that was called Horns in Front, right? Interesting. Yeah. 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 Er yeah. Earlier on in the text. Mm -hmm. That's true. That's true. Well, it's symbolizing something, but it's really not clear why. Right. Sounds like homework, guys. I'm sorry. I think we have to leave it here. Yeah, this is so fun. Thank you again for doing this. Thanks all. Thanks, yeah, thanks. Thank you. See you next week. Bye bye. See you next week. Bye.